Welcome to the bold analysis, ladies and gentlemen. Why is government forcing farmers to take the subsidized fertilizer? Or let me tweak the question. Why is it that Kenyan farmers are not taking the uh, subsidized fertilizer? And government is struggling to explain to Kenyans about the qualities of the new fertilizer that they are currently um, giving farmers. Ladies and gentlemen, I want you to listen keenly to this speech of William Ruto bashing farmers who have refused to take the first uh, subsidized fertilizer. Kwa sababu tumepunguza garama ya mbolea, kuna ukitumia magunia mbili ile ya 50 kilos ya mbolea utavuna between 20 and 25 eh, eh, bags per acre tafikisha hapo kwanza hapa mnaweza hata kufikisha 30 mimi mnanielewa saa hii mnavuna 12 hapo eh, hapo 12 13 kwa ile ile shamba na ile kazi umefanya ni ni mingi hiyo kulima umefanya tayari Kubali that speech, William Ruto, the President of the Republic of Kenya, was speaking in Joro, in Nakuru County. This is a day after he also took photos of, after he visited his farm in Koitalel. I think that is somewhere in Wasingishu. And his farm was doing well. And he said it is because of the first subsidized fertilizer that he has also, he was also expecting bumper harvest i know very well and i want us to look at this critically kindly subscribe to our channel and before you delve deep allow me to remind you about brian's appeal we are finishing up brian is one is a gentleman who suffered and underwent police brutality in kisumu in yalenda that is the trending video we've been seeing there he passed on after seven days in icu and the family had a deficit so we decided to plug in by 50,000 and that is why we am reaching out to you on behalf of this family this money go directly sent to the mother to what they said about the casket and I think a bit of some part of the transport so kindly let's support and also stand with that mother at this critical time I want us to go direct to one clear point this photo William Ruto is showing us how he's expecting bumper harvest. Now, while expecting bumper harvest, I understand very well that the intention of sharing the photo was to show you on how agriculture has worked. But I just ask a simple question. Do you think that William Ruto only has that one business? How many businesses does he have? He's a chicken seller, so he also has eggs. He has not shown us about the eggs. He has a farm. Uh, he has not shown us about farming. Yeah, Maria, where he's running, where he's maybe cows. And strategically, he has picked that for agriculture to show and to portray some information. The reality is dawning on them and i just want to look at it holistically the farmers seems to have refused to take it because it is not the best for them that's number one it's not the best and i have listened to ruto saying that that fertilizer they did soil test and they've done they've done the test of the soil that is used to there and they think it is the best now if the test was done Clearly, let's try to reason. Is this the soil quality, is it the same in all the areas from Mount Kenya to Rift Valley? <laughs> you know. And let me tell you people, when something, a policy is being spoken by the politician, then you know it is politics. If it is a matter of soil quality that has matched the fertilizer, that is being supplied, then that is well explained by an expert. 
from the ministry and it's the closed doors with the farmers where farmers where they can have two-way discussion farmer will say Mimi, I've tried this. It has always failed. But remember, President Tegi, it's one way. And this is one thing that has always happened, that when politicians speak, it's one way. Who can challenge William Ruto on the podium that Mimi, I've had this, I've had that. This thing is not matter of to be done by the politician. And clearly, there is the politics of fertilizer. I said it again. Kenya Kwanza thrives in propaganda. The politics of fertilizer is one that is very, very unfortunate that we are playing politics with something very important as that. Let me tell you, I tend to see here, there is one narrative that we've always asked Kenya Kwanza to come out and counter and they failed. Is it the fertilizer that we are selling, that we that we've subsidized to farmers is it that we've tested the soil and chose that as the best or we have got a cheap fertilizer from russia and it's whatsoever it is that we are giving the farmers there is a big difference between the two the decision to change from dap to the new fertilizer i don't know which one they are giving someone will tell me in the comment section i believe so the decision to leave, drop DAP for that one is not on, I tend not to see an expert input. It is just that we've had a cheap fertilizer from Russia that was donated to us. And after donation, we repackaged and processed it. And that is what we have given to farmers. So what has been lightly mentioned as subsidy, we've said that government should just come and challenge that, okay, we have subsidized fertilizer, money has been paid from treasury to XYZ, and it is not the fertilizer from Russia. What and why the farmers seem to have declined is they've realized that what is being given and packaged as subsidy is just available fertilizer. But because we want to play optics and tell the whole country that we have subsidized fertilizer, we need to play politics. And the fertilizer politics is strategically targeting the farming areas, Mount Kenya and the Rift Valley Maize Belt. It's actually targeting these areas, the Coffee Belt and the Maize Belt. Coffee, the Mount Kenya, of course, there have been the issue of the new fertilizer and the maize farming in Rift Valley. So that William Ruto would actually use that to woo them the masses that, the farmers that, I literally care for you. The fertilizer is pure politics. And if what I'm saying is wrong, then sample videos of the HOS, head of state, speaking in Mombasa, speaking in Makweni, speaking in Nyanza, or speaking somewhere in, you know, in Kajado, do you hear Ruto speaking about fertilizer and speaking in those areas apart from Mount Kenya and Rift Valley? It is one that has been commodified or it has been modeled as a political achievement. And it's very clear that I seem not to see the, the discussion about with the Tumepima and the soil and we being the I don't seem to buy it. It seems that we just have a cheap fertilizer from Russia. Whether it is the best for the farmer or not, it's another discussion. Now, if it will fail to give the produce that is needed, there is another blame. They can blame the rainfall. They can blame the rain. They can blame the farmers on the quality of the soil. They can tweak the blame. But at least for the moment, we gave some subsidized fertilizer. It is just for that optics. Number three. Ruto is struggling and Kenya Kwanza is struggling to prove to Kenyans that we have a plan on food security. So it is some dummy implementation of a plan in food security. Well, in real sense, if the farmers have declined to take that new fertilizer, and I remember Ruto telling them, who told you that DAP is the best? But farmers seem to be pushing that DAP. They seem to be they seem to want another species 
of fertilizer apart from what the GOK is giving. So government is in a fix and the whole discussion about fertilizer is just working, is just thriving under the rider. We want to subsidize production and not consumption. That's why we've been told about the fertilizer. It is just to, you know, to, to give that rider strength that we are subsidizing production and not consumption. Something is not clear. And that video of William Ruta begging farmers to take that or asking, telling farmers to take that and drop the other one and they should not bother him around him, looks like the government has realized that farmers are not taking it. It is not. Because if it will be the best, they will actually scramble for it. But there seems to be selling the fertilizer from Russia, irrespective of whether it is what the farmers want or not. That's the, the gospel truth. Let's meet in the next. え、これ、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま、ま